Maybe you've heard the adage about some business deals being made at the point of a gun. But how about deals that are done with both parties holding guns? And they're loaded. On America This Afternoon, Mike Hegedus heads to the Pine Forest of South Georgia to do a little negotiating. From the minute the dogs are loaded at 6.15 in the morning and... We're going to need four mules you know, and mule uh, now, I can help two wagons. The mules are brought in to be hitched. You know this is going to be a different kind of business outing. This is our version of taking people to play golf or going out and having a fine dinner or whatever. Uh, but it's something unique. Yeah. You are quail hunting in the longleaf pine timber of South Georgia. Wing shooting in this state brings in hundreds of millions of dollars, but these particular birds sit on some of the 6,000 acres owned and leased by the Pine Hill Plantation, one of the most exclusive shooting destinations in the country, and one of less than 100 Orvis-endorsed lodges. They feed off of each other. So the Orvis name is, in, is associated with an, with an operation like this that's great for us, it's great for them. We see a niche for uh, high net worth and high income individuals who want to come bird hunt but also are accustomed to going to very nice places. Doug Coe owns and operates Pine Hill, bought it outright a couple of years ago. After building up and selling his own very successful Atlanta-based company, he followed his passion for bird hunting and his business acumen to the sunset huge shores around Lake Seminole in Colquitt. We see our business customers bring their best customers to say thank you or to bring their high potential customers and show them something really special. But then what really pays the dividends is they get the chance to spend a day or two days with a customer in ways that they could never do in any other business setting. At $5,000 a night for a group of four, you get to practice your shooting on the skeet range, a private lodge for your group with its own chef and housekeeper. And you get to hunt in the old world gentlemanly way, on horseback or in mule-drawn wagons. You would be amazed at how much you can learn about another person if you ride on the back of a horse together all day long. The art of the deal being practiced in the forest, maybe the dog smells a merger. On America, Mike Hegedus, CNBC, in Colquitt, Georgia.